Greetings everybody, this is Shannon Evad. I am out in the beautiful desert. I just like check down, like there's nothing around me, is there? There's no snake or scorpion at my feet, um, which is interesting because I'm speaking about friendships. Guys, in this season, we have been hearing the voice and the words of so many accurate prophets who came into this season saying, there's a great shaking happening in our world there is a shaking happening in our world. Everything that can be shaken is being shaken. We also, including myself, believe that this was a season where God was separating the wheat from the tare. And listen, God can't separate the wheat from the tear without that impacting our personal relationships. So many of you have experienced the exit of people from your lives. This is such a season of pruning and purging, but for every departure, there is a divine alignment. I don't really know if people in the Bible who didn't go through betrayal before elevation. I mean, Jesus needed Judas, right? That was a part of his positioning uh, on the cross. Uh, Joseph needed his brothers. Joseph is really an archetype of the Christ. There was that betrayal that cast him in the pit, but that pit took him to the palace. There was that betrayal of Jesus that put him on the cross, but that cross secured his crown. So there will always be a betrayal before your crown. There will always be a falling away before an alignment. And I don't know about you, but I actually went out with some friends the other day and I was like, I feel like I'm losing some of my friendships, right? And I kind of prided myself in having the same friends for 20, 30 years. And one of my girlfriends who I was out to lunch with when I told her that, she said, Shannon, and she works in the entertainment industry. She said, Shannon, that's really a poverty mentality to try to hold on to your crew from like when you were 10 and 11 years old. She said, because you've evolved, you've changed. She said, I've seen so many of these, you know, the, these hip hop people and some of these people try to take everybody with them to the promised land and it ends up bankrupting them. And so you can't take everybody with you um, there are some friends who are there for a lifetime, some for a reason, some for a season, but I promise you there has been a purging in this season. Don't take it personal. God is aligning us. He's getting things ready for the purpose, for the destiny that is waiting for us in this crucial, crucial hour. We know the days that we're in are short. We know that we're seeing so many things prophetically, even from scripture come to pass. So don't think uh, or don't be caught by surprise when it hits your personal relationships. Nothing inauthentic can survive this season. Nothing that is not authentic, nothing that is not aligned with your next season of destiny will survive this season. So I just wanna encourage you, if people leave your life if you see an exit, just know that also there is going to be a divine alignment. God is going to add people who are assigned to your destiny, who are assigned to your purpose. Uh, there won't be snakes. Yeah, I'm looking down again. There won't be snakes and scorpions in the camp. Um, there won't be people with ulterior motives. There will be people who are aligned with where God has you. Uh, I just want to give you guys a little peek at this mountain behind me. It's so beautiful. Can you guys see it? the mountain. Can you see the mountain? God is taking us to the mountaintop. And guess what? When you're going to the mountaintop, you can't afford to have extra weight. When you are walking to the mountain, you can't have rocks in your backpack. And some of us have been carrying people in these relationships. Some of us have been carrying people um, out, of a, out of a loyalty to what is old. And I'm not saying we're going to, you know, miss out on every relationship. Obviously, there are friends who are there for life. But in this season of this great shaking, this separating from the wheat from the tear, as scripture says, a lot of the people that you came up with you won't be elevating with. And I don't want you to take it personal. I actually had a moment where I took it personal. I was like, what's happening? But God reassured me, this is all by design. This is all about your elevation. This is all about what I'm doing in this new season. So I just wanna encourage you to know the same. For every departure, there's a divine alignment. And for every shaking, there's a reestablishing of the foundation for this next season of purpose. Remember, Nothing can survive this season if it's not authentically aligned to your destiny and purpose for the next season. 
The great shaking is here. It's absolutely hitting our personal friendships and our personal relationships. But the ones who remain, they are the trues, the real trues as we call them in LA. And the ones who are being added, because people are going to be added, divine connections, covenant partnerships, these things will be added for such a time as this, for this next phase of purpose and this next phase of destiny that God is bringing us into to reveal more and more of his glory. Amen. All right. I'll see you guys later. Bye.